Good evening, good evening, good evening, and welcome to a brand new Indigo Worship Live here on Facebook Live and YouTube. We're so happy to have you join us tonight for an incredible, incredible show. And you know what Monday is? It is New Music Monday here on IGW Live, and we've got an incredible artist that's joined us tonight that's going to talk to you about his new single, Reset. So in the meantime, do what you always at, what you always do, which is, hey, like us here on Facebook. If you like this video, also tag and share it. And follow us on Instagram at official Indigo Worship. And for all my music heads, you know what April 25th is. It is the Indigo Inspire and Merge Music Group music, Virtual Music Conference. And we've got some heavy hitters coming in to present to you. None other than Gospel Music Association President Jackie Patillo will be doing a master class. Benita Jones will also be in a, doing a master class. And we have Vice President of Programming for Radio One. Oh man, I, we're excited about this. Colby Tyner will also be doing a master class. And we've got some heavy hitters coming for all of our independent artists. So if you want to register for that, it's $25. And all you have to do to get the ticket is shopindigo.com. That is shop indigo.com to pre-register for your space at the table. So tonight, once again, I want to thank you so much for joining us. And right now, I want to induce our new artist tonight, the one and only, Stefan Stephen Weiler is in the building. I'm going to Wiley. Yes, Wiley. Yes, 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 yes. So thank you so much for being here on the show tonight yes. and uh, talk about your new release, uh, Reset. So how yes. are you? How are you doing? Um, I'm, I'm great. I'm great. And Patrice, I thank you for having me on the show just to share. Um, truly, this is a reset season. Actually, this is the day that Jesus reset the world. Hey. So what better day? <laughs> what better day than to, uh, to appear today and just share uh, my uh, sentiments and about my, my single uh, reset. It's an awesome and up and coming uh, first uh, CD with the Stephen Wally uh, and Friends Project. So I've yeah. uh, got some family members and got some people that's going to be helping me out. Um, uh, it, it's the song derives from uh, just basically thinking about how it was so simple back in the day. And now it's gotten so complex and can't even walk outside without a mask. Mm, absolutely. <laughs> you know, so it's got things have changed. But I do know that uh, uh, if once God begins to do some things, uh, we're going we're gonna to be in a much better place. But reset, meaning I'm taking it from the beginning. And I'm um, tapping that one more time because I know that God has uh, his promise. And uh, I trust him through his word that when you reset, uh, it says lay aside every weight and sin that so easily beset us. Well, yeah. it came from me having to reset to change my life in order to even come to this place where God spared me enough to save me here today to talk to you and be blessed to be in uh, the presence of your Facebook family, Instagram. Um, so thank you so much uh, for having me. And, like I said, a reset, you'll definitely hear a lot more even uh, after reset comes from the Step Wild and Friends Project. Absolutely. And, you know, you talk about this time of the year. You know, we would have celebrated Easter yesterday. And uh -huh. it dated from Good Friday through Easter and just yeah. the remembrance of what it took to redeem us, to reset us spiritually, to re reconnect us and reset us in, in right standing with, you know, with the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. So yes, at yes. a very high price, resetting is not cheap. Mm -hmm. No. No, resetting is not cheap. So even in our own lives, um, we learn from our mistakes and we look at things, experiences we've been through. And so to make a decision to reset, that is a choice in, in a really positive, positive direction. So I yes. really commend you on just putting that out here and putting this project out here. And you've got yes. some friends. And we have yeah. some mutual friends on here that I'm really excited about that you yes. collaborate with as well. So, but I don't want to say yeah. the names. I want you to say the names. So we've got yeah. some uh, familiar family members and friends on here. Yeah. And we just have a uh, few. Uh, we have uh, Chris Graham, Titus mm -hmm. Martell, E. Daniels. Yes. Uh, Dave uh, Downing and Mikey White. Um, so, and uh, like I said, it's just, uh, uh, it's, uh, it, they, they were awesome gave, working together. Um, my, one of my friends, uh, good friends, helped me write the tune, Deborah Edgefield and Stan, uh, the man, and uh, the Vincent uh, Edgefield uh, helped me to do, uh, put the song together. So uh, my man, Stan, the man, other than another Stan, helped me to remix it, mm -hmm. the new new, that's what we yeah. call it. Uh, so um, 
I believe that it's uh, set for a time such as now where the young people might be able to jump on a little bit better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. So yeah. and, uh, when did you decide, you know what, I'm going to get into the studio, bring my family and friends together and uh, co-laborers in the ministry of music together to really put this project in place? I, I, I started after this project was started before uh, COVID, but when COVID hit, it just messed a lot of things up. So I, I sort of had to bring it back out. But before that, I've been doing uh, music since I've been about 18 years old. Yeah. Um, and, and then uh, put a group together, signed a big contract with Sony and some things happened. And, and I've always been connected with different friends that have uh, gifts and family members, everybody sings. So I always wanted to bring together a type of compilation. Um, I've, I've, I've been with the wine the commission to, to uh, A&R with Michael from McCarry from Boys the Men and Nerd J. Barrett. So I've always had a little hand in it. Yeah. So this, this is pretty much uh, going to be probably one of my last projects. You know, um, I, I preach and trying to get my life together and get some things into perspective. And sometimes when you try to do too many things, you can't focus on the thing that God really has for you to do. It's okay to do uh, some other things, but I just wanted to slow down a little bit. So I was planning on this being one of those projects where it slows me down, but COVID wouldn't let that happen. So yeah. I had to come back and hit it again. Mm -hmm. and now God opened some doors right at, at the end of this season where this project came back heavier, um, better, and now I have another uh, song coming out within another month. So, I mean, sometimes we think one thing, but God says another. So I can't cancel what God's already started. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. So you're doing two re two single releases from the project itself. What up, man? Good, good. <laughs> Say it one more time. You're doing, you're doing two single releases on this project. Yeah, I have about three, actually, in total. Okay. Um, it's going to be about three. But um, uh, right now, this is the first one. And then, like I said, uh, the second one, probably about a month out. And then wow. that third one, probably about two, two, two or three months out there, but it's definitely coming. Well, you no, know, as we as we are all in this pandemic, it's definitely not one that's, you know, just an individual. We're all experiencing this. Um, from the time when you really, when we got blindsided, but yeah. along the way, what have you personally learned about your relationship with God during this process of, you know, getting this album out? Well, uh, I, I've learned that uh, delay is not denied. Um, I've learned that, you know, it just, you know, you, you, you take it, you know, day by day, trust in God. Because a lot of times if God stops or, 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 or has something go another direction, sometimes he's just taking you around some things so that you don't have to go through some things. Mm -hmm. um, and sometimes, so you just, I've learned just to be patient. I've learned to be uh, prayerful and um, more than ever just trust in God. Yeah, um, you say you also you also speak as well. Um, yes. What have you found to be the most challenging thing about this through this process? Uh, making sure that you know you're not forsaking one or the other. I mean, because the Bible says if you take your hand from the plow, you're unfit for the kingdom. So sometimes you want to let one go and, and then continue to do some other things. But I, I, God is teaching me, as I said you know, just to really stay focused and um, just keep myself, because I don't think that one's gift is bigger than the other. I think yeah. that they all need to be nurtured. I don't think that God gives any talents for us to forsake them. I believe that they're all, you know, the gifts and callings come without repentance. But when you're called, then you have a duty. And the duty is to make sure that the people get what God has for you to give them. Absolutely, absolutely. So in terms of, before we even play the single, because I really want people to get, that do not know you, to really get a chance to hear your heart concerning the project uh, and concerning Reset, because it's very transparent. I mean, you really go back to the beginning, literally to the yeah. beginning. <laughs> literally to sure. the beginning. To the beginning. And what that means in terms of really having, you're, 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 you're really exposed and many of us, even through this process, are finding our emotions being more exposed. Um, isolation brings out either better characteristics or they mm -hmm. bring out worse characteristics. Yes. And we found ourselves through COVID being closer to the Lord or pulling back from the Lord because we just don't know what this season is and how long we're going to be in this season. Also combined with we've lost friends. I know you have. You've probably lost friends, loved ones yes. through this pandemic. 
And so when we talk about being, I'm, I'm just going to put a word out there if it's on the album, on the, on the single, uh, being naked, yes. being vulnerable. Uh -huh. let's, 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 let's talk about that a little bit. Um, just being able to know when the Adam walked into uh, in, into the, uh, in the garden and, and he had sinned, you know, God asked him, who told you that you were naked when he asked him um, <laughs> what was going on with him? And he was trying to hide himself, yeah. you know? Um, so uh, that's just paraphrasing. Um, and God had asked him, who told you that you were naked? So some of us don't realize that God even sees, you know, even when you don't realize that he's looking, he's looking and he knows. So um, it's just the fact of knowing that God uh, is merciful, you know. What I mean, that's one. And, and and as long as you want to be what God needs you to be, He'll take care of you. He'll get you right back when you need to be. Absolutely, absolutely. And after this weekend, we are reminded once again, He'll get you right back where He needs to get you at the cost yes. of His own expense. Yes. And that in and of itself just draws you close to Him and just mm -hmm. make you more, fall more in love with Him because God, yes. Lord, you would, you didn't leave me out there. Yes. But you really love me that much to redeem me. And, yeah. you know, our lives really should speak of every day with gratitude. So uh, thank you so much for your heart for music and for putting yes. this record out and really getting to the heart of where it all began, but letting us know that we can have a reset in the Lord. So to all our listeners here on Indigo Worship Live, hey, right now we're going to listen to this, this new single from this pro brand new project by Stefan Weiler, Reset. Yeah, yeah. All we wanted to be was be. 
Stefan Wiley here on Indigo Worship Live premieres yes. his single here on this platform. We are so yes. thankful for that. You know, I love that. We want to go back. Got to go back. You know, got to go back. Yeah, got to go back. And that's where we find our greatest covering, um, spiritually, emotionally, mentally, and our greatest joy. So yes. uh, now we know that this is available on all platforms. Yes, all the streaming. Uh, outfits, all the uh, digital uh, platforms, uh, you can go grab it. Uh, like I said, uh, this is the new new. So um, you guys support your brother, your friend, your your, your, your uncle, your, your yes. god brother. Yes. You know? Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. So everyone, please support this project. It is available on all digital platforms for streaming it. But more importantly, hey, support it and purchase this single and purchase the whole album. We independent artists really need your support during this time, especially when we're not doing any shows publicly. So your financial support of just buying their products really helps their ministry and can, they can continue to put new music out for you to enjoy and be blessed by. So Stefan, thank you so much for being here on Indigo Worship Live. We appreciate thank it. Thank you for having me, Patrice. Thank you. Thank you. And for all our listeners, we thank you so much for being a part of this new Music Monday. And once again, reminding you, hey, follow us here on Facebook at Indigo Worship Live Show on Instagram at official Indigo Worship. And don't forget, hey, that Power Up Virtual Music Conference, which is filled with some heavy hitters, get your tickets because there are only so certain spaces in that virtual master classrooms. And you really, we've got some information for you that some of those other, other conferences do not do not have. So promise you, you will not want to miss it. So get your registration at shopindigo.com and it's only $25 just to, to register for, the, for those classes. So we'll see you April 25th at three o'clock. And once again, on Indigo Worship Lab Show, it's not just a vibe here, baby. It's a whole mood. Have a wonderful, Amen. wonderful night. Amen, be blessed. Amen, God bless you. Amen.